What's up, Blockheads? Tammy from the Block. Doing the do. I know you guys. I just wanted to say thank you to all you guys that have been commenting, saying, where are you, girlfriend? We miss your videos. I cannot tell you how much that means to me. I, I looked and my last video was 1219. So it's been, you know, three weeks or so. Um, and I'm just going to get real with y'all. This breakup that I went through has been really, really, really tough on me. Um, emotionally, financially, extremely tough. Um, and so, um, you know, I've been healing a lot, but, um, there's also been a lot of positives too. Okay. Um, Braylon has, his behavior, his aggressive um, behavior has improved so much since um, the negative energy is out of the house, let's just say, okay? We're just going to um, keep this um, on the high road, okay? <laughs> um, I want to have a shout out to my cousin, Lindsay. Um, she was in um, town last week for knee surgery and I got to see her. Hi, sweetie girl. I miss you. I miss you. I miss you. I hope I get to see you next week. Although I am going to be doing a special project thing next week. So I don't know if we can meet up for lunch or not, but we'll touch base. Okay. So I'm, I, I haven't organized this Dollar Tree stuff. I'm just going to start going. I know I've got enough stuff here for probably two Dollar Tree hauls and um, like I said things have been financially tough for me because I'm paying all this stuff here by myself now so um, anyways I got a gift card for Christmas so and I found some good stuff some good good stuff um, there are a lot of the new stickers out you guys look at this so you know my as you probably know um, most of my my downstairs and a lot of my upstairs a lot of my house is all faith god christian based decor um and so this will go right right along with all that it says faith it does not make things easy it makes them possible and that's luke 137 from the bible and boy if that isn't the truth um you know faith is the things that you can't see and um, faith is always something that I've prided myself on, you guys. So I hope I don't get emotional during this video, okay? And um, two of the things that I always thank God for every day are his grace and mercy. And I have a beautiful iron sign over there that says Amazing Grace. But I found this sign, sticker sign, it says Amazing. And then you peel, peel the grace off and Amazing Grace. So that'll go up in my house. And then this one, look at it. Jesus loves you. Yes, he does. You know, I, if, if there's some of my, my viewers out there, whatever, that aren't Christians, that's okay. I, I, you know, I'm not trying to offend you or anything like that, but there is no way I'm going to deny my faith on my YouTube channel for anybody. Um, just keep that in mind. Okay. Um, we got some other things. We got a juicer here, which I thought was really cool just to have on hand because sometimes I do buy big bags of lemons and I need to squeeze the lemon juice out. So I got that one like that, pink one. I made homemade thick egg noodle, um, chicken noodle soup the other day and I used all my seasoning chicken cubes. So I got one of those to put back up in my spice rack. I picked up... Did I pick up one or two of these? I don't know. I, I just have one right here um, for, well, if I only picked up one, it's going to go in my um, granddaughter Allegra's um, Valentine package. If I picked up two, then the other one's going to go on my little play shelf that I have in my bedroom. And I know I've been promising you guys all a video of a tour of my house, and I, I will do that soon. I still haven't fixed the things that have been broken because... Um, there's been a lot of healing going on and a lot of downtime, but it's coming. So these I found, oh my gosh, and I just loved them. My kitchen is like black and red, but they didn't have any red, so I just picked up. They're like a smaller size. They're not like the big normal size ladle, so I got the ladle. Um, 
a little slotted spoon and a little spatula. And these are kind of like, are they silicone? I think they're silicone. Yeah, silicone. And then, you know, if I've showed you before all the sarcastic little sayings that I have at my desk at work. Um, however, I think I'm going to keep this one here. But there's three of these different signs. I got this one. It says girl boss. Um, there's another one that says this girl can. And I can't remember what the other one says. Comment down below if you remember what it says. I might remember before this video is over. But that's the theme nowadays in my life. Okay, girl boss ran. Um, I picked up this one pineapple upside down cake candle. It was the only one on the shelf, and I love it. I've hauled it before. I love it so much, so I just saw it there, just individually stick it out, so I like threw it in my cart. I picked up two of these glass unicorns. Oh my gosh, you guys, are these adorable or what? I got two of them, one for my little play shelf and one for Miss Allegra's um, Valentine package. I got one of these. Now, they had these last year. Um, and I have the little smaller one and then the little lip glosses sitting on my desk at work. But um, there was not very many left on the shelf. I think there was like three. So I just picked up one just to have here at my house just for some quick hand lotion. I got the new signs at Christmas. They had the ones that said hope, faith, love that were half white and then a glittery glitter, my favorite color. Um, but these are like a silvery gold kind of. It almost looks like the back is gold and the front is silver, but um, these are for my little play shelf. Well, I don't know. They might not be for my play shelf. I might put them around my house some more, but there's one that says peace. I got all three of them. Brave. And love. So cute. So cute. It's fun now because these Dollar Tree hauls can be really selfish for me um, because Christmas is over. Um, I did pick up one of these wooden signs, and I don't normally pick up these things because I, you know, unless I have something, you know, in mind what to do with them. But what I thought I would do with this one, I got the, is Braylon and I have a lot of stickers. So I picked up one of these love wood craft signs, and I thought we would just take the stickers out one day and just like decorate it all and just cute stickers and kind of make like a sticker use the sticker as stickers as kind of like wallpaper and decorate it that way because something easy for Braylon to do. He won't get frustrated. We can just stick them on there. So I'll let you know how that turns out. Okay, this stuff, you guys, has been missing in action from the Dollar Tree for months. And I wish I would have picked up more when I found them because I only got two. I sat and ate one bag the other night, so I only have one left. And I was just in the Dollar Tree yesterday and they had none. So what I like to use to, um, the, I like to put these on my salad. It gives my salad like a sweet little flavor. Like, like I like to put raisins on it too, but these coconut flakes are so good on salads. Um, however, I always thought coconut was good for you. Um, a couple months ago, I was at the doctor and my triglycerides were, were high. So I googled what not to eat to help your tri tri my tri blah, 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 that. Um, and it said all things coconut to stay away from. And I was like, I had never heard that before. If you've ever heard that before, comment down below. Like everything, coconut, coconut oil, coconut flakes. It said stay away from it. That is the first time I've ever heard that because I always thought coconut oil was the best oil or one of the good oils. Um, so yeah, that's what it said. Let me know if you've ever heard that before because I had never heard that before. And I told my girlfriend who is a health guru and she's like, I have never heard that. So Braylon got one of these for Christmas in a stocking from my mom and my grandson loved it, just loved it. And Braylon was getting mad because he was taking his little um, arrows. So I picked Avery up one of these. I'll put this in his little Valentine thing or I might give it to him before. Um, I only picked up a couple signs so far. Um, I picked up this one that says love every moment. This is like the cloth one with the bar and the rope on it. 
picked up another cloth one that says follow your heart and then these are the wood signs this one says love each moment That's the wood signs like they had at Christmas you know it's got gold in it I'm kind of starting to like gold some now but I but I don't know silver glitter is still the bomb my granddaughter Allegra said something at Christmas that I thought was so funny. Now keep in mind, she's 11 and she came into my life two years ago. She said, okay, and she, she's like my, like my reincarnation. It's amazing how we're so alike. Um, she loves all things pink. She loves all things glitter. She loves all things unicorn. Actually, she got me to like unicorns, but she said at Christmas, and I about died laughing, if you can't breathe glitter, why breathe it all? I would say something like that. I was like, oh my gosh, Allegra. That is so me and Grammy Tammy. You're so you and Grammy Tammy. Um, I got this wood one. It says, happy Valentine's Day. And this was the last one, so I know they have a white one, um, but I got the red one. It just says, love. Got the little tin stuff right here. So got that. Just a repurchase, a couple packs of gum, because you always got to keep the mouth fresh. Let me grab another bag. Okay. Along the same lines with the Valentine stuff, I did pick up one of these little white bears with the red heart, and it says love. And I just thought Braylon would think that was cute to hang up on the door or something. So got that. Everybody's been hauling these glittery, cute bags. So I had to pick one up. It's so pretty. So, so pretty. Here's what it, uh, the side looks like. It has hearts. So it is a Valentine bag, apparently. Um, wow. It's like that marbled effect. I love the marble effect. I picked up, of course, the unicorn Valentine bag for Allegra's Valentine. It says, have a magical. And it's glittery on one side and then smooth on the other and then the side has the hearts I picked up this Valentine bag which is glittery on one side smooth on the other and then stripes down the side that's so cute and then I found the two pack littler mermaid bag so you get one that has glitter on it and then one that doesn't have glitter so two for a dollar um, they're a smaller size so got that just to have on hand for whatever i got a little bear tic-tac-toe game braylon doesn't really get the concept of this game yet so i really want to work with him um, and teach him how to play tic-tac-toe so i got that just for fun for braylon I got this for fun for Braylon. They had a robot one and then this one, and it comes with a little easel. Is that cute? So this one just has two teddy bears, and I thought, oh, that's me and Braylon. So we'll do that for a craft project. Let's see here. What else do I have? Oh, I found everybody's been hauling these foil stickers with the bottles, the perfume bottles. There was one. This was it. This was it. This is the one that looks like the ornaments, which is actually my least favorite, um, but I got it. I haven't found any of the other ones, so it's got 12 stickers on it by Jot. And then I got two of these because I just thought they were so cute. They've got the googly eyes um, on them. There's 25 stickers, so look at what's on there. Um, there's a sloth, an ice cream, a taco, a llama, sushi, a pizza, a watermelon, a puppy, a strawberry. I just thought, oh my gosh, a piece of pie. They were way too cute, so I had to get two of them. So I got that. I got, how many did I get of these? So I got four, six of these for Braylon to take to school for his Valentine. Each of these has a little finger skateboard on it. Last year, he took the ones that had the dinosaurs on it. So my TV just came on. 
by itself. Um, so yeah, we got so I got six of these, so he has enough for both his classes, so they each have a little finger skateboard on it. There's six of them in each bag. One says slam dunk, I think you're cool, you rock. I only have eyes for you, you're my hero, sweet. So I got those. I also picked up this one just because I thought it'd be fun to play with and they're just suckers um, with 12 valentines in it and it says color your mouth pops so you're, they change the color of your tongue. I got those. I got um, socks. Okay, how many pair of socks did I get? I don't need any socks, Lord knows, but you know how I am with the Dollar Tree socks. So I got myself a pair of the lips, of course. Me and my lips. I got lip stickers on my car. I, my license tag has lips on it. I got little decorations inside, lips. Um, and then I got these, they're longer. They're the heart with the arrow through it. And then this heart-shaped donut one and then I got the hand towels um, one for each of my daughter-in-laws and one for myself there's two different kinds this one's just red with a heart and I think it says XO on it so I got three of those and then three of these which are pinkish and say XO XO so I got three of those and then some candy just because sometimes there's people over here and they're like, Do you have any chocolates? So I got two bags of Snickers for the pantry. I got some Twizzler bites for the pantry. I got some Kit Kat minis for the pantry. And then I got this because I hadn't seen this before. It's the double bubble bubble gum and it's got three flavors in it. It's got watermelon, grape, and apple. So got one pack of those. And then these planner stickers I thought were so cute. So I got those. They've got some puffy ones on the front with a camera, a llama, magic, sunglasses. Um, let me just open these and see. Maybe I'm not going to be able to open them. You can see on the back, there's 175 stickers in there. So quite a few in there for a planner. And then I had a whole bunch of Valentine cards picked up, but I was like, no, just get a couple of the cute ones and pick up a couple at a time. So I did get this one, of course, for Allegra. It says Valentine. It's got a unicorn on it. Valentine, you're one of a kind. Wishing you a magical day. So I got that one for her. And then I don't know who this one's going to be for. I just thought it was cute. It's got donuts and coffee on it. And it says, I do not know what I would do without you. I love you a latte. Happy Valentine's Day. Is that cute or what? Um, I, I guess I do have a couple more things I'll do here. And then we'll finish out this Dollar Tree haul. Um, I know that they've got more than just this one, but this is the only one I found. This one says little but fierce. And it's a notebook. And God knows I need another, I don't need another notebook, but they're so cute. They're so cute. So I got that. Um, and then I did find the really cool headbands that they have. I just got the white one. There was like three different colors. I loved all three of them, but I buy all these headbands and then I never wear them because as you have seen in my video many times, I always got sunglasses on my head. I wear sunglasses as an accessory. I don't wear them on my eyes from the sun. They're an accessory on my head. My coworkers laugh at me all the time. But. And then I did find this Get Fit kit and it's got cards and dice in it. It's a fun and exciting way to keep active. So I don't know. I haven't opened it up, but apparently you, the dice has, or the die has a color on it. And then whatever color you land on, you read that card and you have to do the activity. looks like. So I thought that would help to get me in shape because I'm up a few pounds, folks. I do so good, and then I do so bad. Um, that's it for tonight, Blockheads. Thank you so much, and thank you for all the love and prayers and all of you that said, where have you been? I'm here. I'm here. Chugging along. I'll be all right. Um, don't forget to like, 
Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share. Send me some love down below. I love you guys. Um, and we will catch you in the next video.